All right, so we're arriving at the uh, Port Autonomy de Dakar, which, from my understanding, is the port that you need to get on to go to the island that has this slave castle or slave museum. So it looks like the entrance is over there. We're going to check and see if we can go in here first. So, yeah, we need to go in through this side. So let's do that. Yeah. If you talk, if you don't talk, you don't, you don't talk to us, you never know. Yeah. We. Oui. You from America? Excuse me. Yeah. Huh? From oui. America. We. Oui. We are from here. We know everything from the town. Today is the day of the market. Really? You don't know the market. You understand? Yeah. The market, the woman, them, and the baby, and the bike. Oh. Today is the day. That's why I'm talking to you. The market is there. If here you have time, I just walk around with you. I saw you somewhere. Maybe you understand. Okay. What's your name? Austin. Austin. My name is Austin. All right, Inshan. Inshan. How long you are sitting there? Uh, Umsuman. Umsuman. You are here in Dakar. Yeah. You want to walk around something? I'll help you for that. Yeah, I need to walk over here first. Okay, here. That guy just lectured me because they're selling hats and beads. And they were asking me, hey, excuse me. I was like, no, no, I'm good. And they're like, he just lectured me about I would never have a friend in Africa if I thought that everybody that talked to him wanted money. It's only right for me to think that when you got a lot of stuff sitting on top of your head, literally, for sale. Good friend, speak okay. English very well. Speak English yes, very well. Very, very, very well. This is your first time. It's good Hello, for me. Good. Hello. Hello. Okay. Yeah. I'm you? the corner. I live on gold. Okay. We have this. The better guy, you don't get it. Better than me. Well, there won't be a better guy than you. I'm telling you. Obama, it was me who take care yes. of him. Okay. Yeah. With good. My best friend is Icon. You don't miss him. Yeah. Really, your best friend is Icon. No, no, no. I'm a good gender. So the, the ticket for a non uh, Senegalese person is 5000 yeah. 200. So we're going to get the ticket now. Yeah. So it just started raining. Now we're getting on the ferry though in just enough time. Said all the houses there are minimum 300 years old. There's oh. no nothing there is new at all. So it's been untouched. Yeah. Of course, because Portuguese 15th century came, it start to celebrate 16th century, 1536, the beginning of celebration, and then the Dutch, then the British, then the French, all fight against each other to control this island because the, the location. Yeah. Okay.
Yeah. All right, so now we're gonna buy a ticket to go yeah. see, to yeah. have yeah. access yeah. to the house and everything else. Yeah. 900 meters long, 300 meters wide. All right. 1,000 people today. So he said the police station was the first building yeah. built by the Portuguese. In 1481. In 1481. And you said that all the buildings are built out of the black stones right the here. Black stone because Gora used to be a volcanic eruption. It's uh, all from a volcanic eruption. Yeah. And cement, they used to using some seashells. Yeah. Okay. That's why, but he was a church before. Oh, this is a church and now yeah, it's the police. In 1481, he was a church. Okay. After hospital, fishing market, now to be the present to police station. Okay. But I can tell you African problem. It start when European discovering America by Christopher Columbus. Was in 1492. So flowing, the development of different plantations like sugarcane, alcohol, etc. They first sent some Europeans today to work on plantation. But very hard work and the climate was very strong for them. The Indians were the local people. Really? Indians should exploiting against a lot and they should dying a lot. So now to free the Indians, one Mexican archbishop called Bartolome de las Casas. Incan, Incans in South America? Yeah. Oh, okay. And they say, black people didn't have a soul. To get up to heaven, you have to treat them like slaves. That is the first idea of slave trade here promoted by the church. Because automatically, the king of Spain, he signed the authorization to the Europeans officially and legally to start the slave trade here. It was in 1536 that the Portuguese started to build the first house of slaves of Gore Island. Okay. Step by step, Gore becoming the most important transit center. Okay. 20 million transit here and 6 million died. Bad treatment. You've been sick or agonizing, they should throw you on the ocean. But all houses on the seaside on Gore used to be houses of slaves. So we're going to be the last one. Built in, 18, no, in 1780 by the Dutch. It's the only one remains slave house used by Senegalese government like a symbol. Because the particularities are though on the seaside. Gate of no return. So we're going to start our visit from that house and then you can get walk around time you will okay get, yeah you maintain the colors and the architectural the door of return hotel yeah you see is the city council they restore it We have conditioned air, Wi-Fi, everything. Okay. Yeah, the PV. We have 12 of them, but this is the relation. The black high beans, everything, first they grow it in Africa was here. The first botanical garden yeah. in Africa. Yeah. And, the and now it's a tennis court and yeah. a soccer yeah. basket. Okay, so they, they took it out. Now. Why did they do that? Yeah, but here now, for the population, they need something to play football or basketball because oh. they don't have space on Gore. Oh, okay. It's very small, 900 meters and 300 meters. Okay. In 1670, French opening this garden. 1670, they opened this garden. Come, I show you here. Michel Adanson. Yeah. He was signing here by the Indian company. He was the one who proposing universal method of classification. Now, call it the yeah, numerical or Adamsonian taxo money. Okay. See how they built houses on Gore. You see the green because it's the seashells. Oh. You get it? Seashells, when you get it, it's that they give you. Oh, okay, okay. You see? Okay, yeah. so yeah, it's built out of seashells and these yeah. volcanic rocks. Yeah, and yeah. the volcanic is how they fix all houses on Gore. Okay. A boat. Yeah. Same like this one. Yeah. Okay. 
Because during the trip to America, there were 30% person they die before they get drunk, before they move. 30% they, they die before they left? Yeah, during the trip, I mean. Wow. So they used to keep in them on houses, same way on the ship. Oh, wow. Yeah, just like Oh, so it's built like a ship, and yeah, they used, they used to stack them in there the same way? Yeah, just to prepare them. Wow. I mean, if you know, if you can survive on this area, so pro probably mm -hmm. so you can survive during the trip. Mm hmm so it was 8,000 for the ticket to go to see access to the house and everything else that we want to see for the trip so like he was saying he said all these houses were built in the shape of the ship that way that I guess they could be trained to sit on the same positions that they would on the ship for six months or however six weeks or however long it took to get there which is pretty uh, gruesome if you ask me so I just want to start with the door of no return before people came. Okay, so this is yeah, the house of flare, but you can start the tour here. Okay, so this we're gonna start the tour. You step by step. Okay, step by step. Yeah. But this house was built in seventeen eighty by the Dutch. Okay. It's one of the last they built because the first built by the Portuguese, fifteen thirty six. And inside here, two hundred slaves together. Two hundred? Yeah, two hundred. Men, women, children. Living separately in different cells, How much? sex and age. Wait. Stay maximum three months before shipping to America because they would buy selling boat. Okay. But from the house, family being separate. The father may be to US, mother, brother, or Cuba, children are different principles indeed. The separation was total. They used to left with multiple numbers, never with African names. Once they get there, they took the name of their owners. Today black Americans get British name. Go by Spanish, Brazil, Portuguese, etc. What they get now, we call it the borrowed name. Borrow name. Yeah. Start the man cell. Here. Yeah. All this was the typical cell they reserved for men. Big like 2.6 meters by 2.6 meters. 15 to 20 men each one. 15 and 20 people in yeah. here. They all sitting down back against the wall. They have the chattels on the arm and the chattels on the leg. Really? They should free once a day from cell to outside to losing themselves. Generally, they should live with a very sad bad condition. The first epidemic of plague, Robert is this island in 1779, start from this house. Wow. Next to the main one, actually, it's a short piece, it's a short piece. Next to the main one, we see the children one here. So the children, the mortality rate was the highest. Yeah, there were 30 person they should bear from children, right? Because they say they should sleeping down on the floor, like in the sardine boxes, without any clothes. They were just like a piece of fabric. No but, clothes, yeah. and they slip on the floor. Yeah, and the value of child depending by the teeth, like a horse, to know the age. Oh. Yeah, and price of child was like a, a mirror or tobacco. Because you know, are never using money to get slave. They should trade it. Oh. Alcohol, fire gun, munition, clothes, cover, piece fabric, etc. Because that time, European never getting access on the mainland. Very dangerous for them. They should collaborate with some African tribal chief living all along the coast. Once they get a fire gun from masters, those African chief, they broke on the coast and trading with Europeans. That's why we can really recognize our part of responsibility. Because no buyers, no sellers. Mm. But if those Europeans never came here to get slaves, you never see some African collaboration. So really? that's why we Africans we have to recognize our part of responsibility. Because like 350 years we have played here. Because they should benefit with the collaboration with some of our chiefs living all along the coast to Ghana, Nigeria, Benin, Togo, Sierra Leone. The one they go inside 
When the Europeans came, the, the tribe wars became economical. Exactly, because the only currency to get the gun closest stock from white people was giving slaves. And each African ethnic group using the same way, even to protect themselves against the one who get fire gun. You go to get people inside, you come on the coast and you're trading to get more stuff from white. Because woman being selected by her breasts. Okay. Full breast meaning the virgins. They question four times more because many masters they using sex with virgins. Once you get pregnant, you are free. On Gore or Saint Louis, not part of Senegal, after the child becoming a French citizenship. It was the mulatto from Mother Black, Father White, called here senior, come from Portuguese, good senora. Same like the Creole in the Caribbean. So the virgins was the only one having a privilege. Is this, look at the big stone. If you open it, the middle is hollow, following by a pipeline, who virgin use it as a toilet. Mm -hmm. But now we close it. So this is a toilet for the yeah, virgins. But if you open it, it's hollow on the middle. Yeah and they can take everything to the sea, right under. Oh, By wow. Right? Minimum was 60 kilograms, men 130 pounds. Yes, and that, men never go. They keep them here, give them food to feed them up with some kind of bean. During time, the ship come. If you can't, during three months to get 60, they sell it cheaper on Gore, to be a local domestic, but you never travel to America less than 60 kilograms for men, child by the teeth, woman by her breast. And the men by the weight. Yeah. Punishment sale, recalcitrant troublemakers. As the punishment, they used to fight me. The, trouble, the troublemakers stay in there. Yeah. How many would stay in there? Yeah. The, for the gap security, number never been important. Only problem for them is to shut the door of the slave. I mean six or eight people. Six or eight people could yeah, be in there. Yeah, because there was a punishment. Wow. Yeah, very sad. I remember 91, during visit of Nelson Mandela. Arrived on the door, Mandela himself, he put his security guard to get in there. Mandela is staying two minutes. When he get out, he cry a lot. Come and say, and he said, because this cell make him remind the jail in Robben Island in South Africa. George Bush, 2013. Wow. He says six to eight people will be in the small space right here. George Walker Bush, the one from the 90s. Yeah. He got here, you said he was the only one that didn't feel bad. He started laughing when he saw this. Of course. And that's uh, why people told us you should keep him inside. Oh, wow. Yeah. Mandela, he cried a lot here. Hmm. What a piece of shit. Of you see, when they get on ship, they line up on this corridor. Then bye bye Africa. So before the door. Before they go to the door. Yeah, we, yeah this is the waiting cell. And they, this is the waiting cell. There were two lines of slaves each one. Because two slaves used to share in the same charcoal on the lake. Uh -huh. The middle of the charcoal was a location of one big heavy iron ball. 21 pounds. Each slave used to carry to get on board. 21 pounds, very heavy, I will show you one. And if you was a good swimmer, so impossible to go in far. If you try to jump in, so first you take the other one and you're jumping. And the heaviness of the iron ball, they all sunk in together. Many shots permanently. The reason why any slave been sick or agonizing, directly on the ocean. And after the door, the ship was 40 meters far from the door, but they should build him a wooden bridge. Built with the palm trees one you see here. Slave used it like a walk to get on board. 
But mm. this corridor with the windows was for the guard security. They were all Africans, some collaborate. More bad between brothers. So during they should have been gone like this for someone time to escape. So beaten by the girl and then eaten by the shark. Eaten by the shark? Yeah. So they throw they wow. So this is the door no return. There was a lot of sharks. Yeah, because slept being sick, they threw them on the ocean. Because 28 doors like this was on the island. 28 doors? Yes. This is just the last one we choose like a museum wow six months this is yeah. six months worth of water yeah yeah six months mm -hmm. this exhibition is here okay. by the south africans robin island museum what is this this is a human being ocean is symbolical oh it's just a symbolic oh. yeah because we want to talk about uh, peace Mm -hmm. and uh, liberty and the South Africans they brought it here since uh -huh. six months yeah. you said 60 women were being here on this sir. 60 women yeah because I thought there were 200 together on the house well this is the size of one of my classrooms and only about 25 yeah. kids would be in their max yeah I think almost three times that almost Full grown adults. See, this is a big punishment cell. It's a bigger one of the compared to the other one. Yeah, because the windows after there was a, a, a water. Uh huh. Yeah, water was behind. Get at, enter the wave. The one who are the big problem makers used to keep here. Oh, so they could get flooded. Yeah. Because the particularity is the green color, the humidity. Is. The humidity. If you stay here one two day, you becoming sick. Against, wow. Against pneumonia. And then they throw you in the ocean to the sharks. You got it. So, so, we, this, so this used to flood, and this yeah, would be a punishment yeah. room. Wow. Yeah, that's why many die by a bad treatment. You've been sick or agonizing. They don't want you contaminate the others. Wow. You see the tie? Mm-hmm. Or on the ankle or on the on or on the arm. But it's a copy. So on the middle was the location of the big heavy iron ball. That's why we found by accident. Yeah, you wanna carry this? Uh, see, so you couldn't run. Yeah. Yeah. It lasts 312 years exactly. 312 years. 1536 until 1848. 20 million grounded, 6 million dollars. Select the best African ethnic group was the Yoruba from Nigeria, Benin, etc. This is from the Pink Lake. You heard about the Pink Lake? 
Pink Lake. Yeah, I heard about the Pink Lake. This is my school in Dakar. This is from southern part of Senegal, from Kazanis. This yellow one from northern part of Senegal is a Lumpur Desert. This is from Gore Island. It's a local farm near Lumpur Gore. This one from central part of Senegal. We get this one uh, from Mauritania, the Iron Man Sun. This is from Sahara Desert, from the big desert of Sahara. This is from this is from Tenere, Tenere Desert from Niger, Burkina Faso, Algeria. And this black one is in uh, Dakar. Dakar it is uh, near the big Dakar. And the blue comes from the baobab. Do you know the baobab tree? No. Yeah, this blue is uh, a tree that we call uh, baobab. The, the blue from the baobab mixed with Arabic gum from acacia. Acacia tree. So this is the demonstration. The glue, we make out the shape with the glue and after we put the sun from the darkest colors to the lightest. So this is the most interesting part. So we make out the shape with the glue and after we start putting the sun and it will be always from the dark, darkest color to the lightest one. And it's a technique that is uh, from the School of Fine Arts in uh, Dakar. It was made by the first president of Senegal, Leopold Sedan Senghor. He made it to promote the African art. So if it's nice, he gave me some applause, right? Wow! Get it? Wow! Right, so this is the demonstration. So all the painting that you see here, they were made uh, like that, the same process. Wow! This is how it becomes once it's dry. Once it's dry, it doesn't come out. Because even if it falls down, it makes noise, but nothing is coming out. Wow! Just no water on it. No water. No water. No water. Yes. Right, so if you want to buy one as souvenir, this is the same the small one, 5,000, the small size, these are 10,000, the big one, 20, and 7,500. Do you take court? Uh, if you have, that is the bank here. If you want to some money, okay. we have an uh, ATM. I think I like this one right here. What does that mean? Allah Muhammad. This is uh. the name of God and his prophet. Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. Yeah, I like how that one looks. So this one? is 20? Yeah, 20,000. And which one again? How many are you going to buy? Just one. Because if you buy three, the fourth one will be free. Ah, oh, no, I'm not spending that much money today. Yeah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Wow. Got it. Yeah. The year and my signature. <laughs> All right. Perfect. All right, you guys. If you enjoyed that video, make sure you give it a like, subscribe, yeah. share, leave a comment. Mm -hmm. And when you come out here to the car, you want to do the tour. What's your name again? We get the Colonel. The Colonel. Yeah. Okay, so that yeah. means I need my money back. I paid him for the tour then, because I just gave him a shout out online. Yeah. But he can he can give me a refund for yeah. that since I gave because I'm making more money in the long He's run. A brother of mine. But it, it yeah. wasn't free though. But um, yeah, make sure you share this with somebody that may be interested. If you want to see more content like this, make sure you leave a comment saying that so I can know and tell me what you want to see me do next. And if you really enjoyed it, it's not free and Africa is not cheap. Feel free to hit the cash app, dollar sign, Austin Holloman, or PayPal, Austin Holloman at Gmail, or leave a super thanks at the bottom of the screen. I'll see you on the next video.